everybody, it's me, Corona the Bat, here with another brand new video, and today in this video, guys, I'll be showing you how to get 7,000 plus Primo Gems before the 2.5 update. Yes, you heard me correctly. You guys think this is a clickbait video? <laughs> think again, because I ain't clickbaiting you guys, and this is literally legit. I found a way to get 7,000 plus Primo Gems before 2.5 so you guys can get Yaimiku or Bao because uh for me I'm looking forward to get Bao and hopefully Kozwa comes after that because uh I just can't wait for him to come out but yeah um before I just continue the video make sure you leave a like comment and subscribe hit the post and notification bell so you don't miss any of my brand new videos and if you guys are new to my channel please uh, subscribe and hit the post notification bell so you don't miss any of my brand new content. I think I already said that. I keep on forgetting what I say when I'm speaking, but yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy my video and uh, yeah, let's just get into the video, guys. Here we go. Been a little too nice to y'all. Now I got up price for y'all. Snake eyes on thanks for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. Okay, if you didn't like the video yet, you will not get this house in the future. Yes this house so <laughs> yeah you bet you guys better like before i continue the video make sure you subscribe and hit the post and notification bell so you guys will be notified every time i upload a video all right so first you always have to do commission quests yes yes guys you always have to do commission quests every single day because they are really worth it it gives you 60 primo gems by just completing easy like easy quests i'm not even kidding these are like the easiest quest to do in Genshin Impact. And it, and it gives you 60 pre, Primo Gems in total. So guys, in my opinion, that's pretty much worth it actually. So just make sure you do commission quest every single day. The next thing that you always have to do is make sure you always do the Spiral Abyss. Always. So like every week. So if you go to the Spiral Abyss and go to floor 9, it should uh, be 0 stars. That's because... It resets every nine days and yeah and every time you complete a floor or you know floor 9 floor 10 floor 12 uh, you get 50 primo gems in each floors every time you complete it and in my opinion that's kind of worth it but it's a bit hard if you're a character that like level 70 or level 80 level 80 is fine that's the uh, average amount of levels you need for a character but you need to uh, make sure your level 80 characters are fully built by completing all of these uh you know um dungeons you get 600 primo gems in total yes if you complete every chamber yes i keep on saying floor i mean every chamber um in these floors so guys make sure you grind up your characters a lot of people are actually forgetting this thing so there's like a question mark book in the top left corner and um by clicking on that there might be um a lot of uh you know things that you discovered that you haven't claimed yet so every time you claim them or press the next button you get primo gems literally primo gems and i just literally did the method without me recording it and i did um every uh, i claimed every single one of them and i got 15 primo gems literally 15. all right so genshin impact dropped the new two events um in genshin impact a couple days ago it's not really new but like yeah still uh, recent uh, events and um the two events are the uh the eight locals over mountains and seas which uh the time remaining is seven days so you guys have seven days to complete this and um uh, by speaking of this i haven't even done it i haven't started on it yet but it's pretty much worth it because you i think you get 30 primo gems every time you complete the quest and that should be so 30 plus 30 would be 60 and then 60 plus 30 would be 90 and then 90 plus uh you know guys just hold up i'll be right back i need to do my calculation for this and in total, it should give you 210 Primo Gems. Yes, guys, 210 Primo Gems by doing this event. And another event is the fleeting colors in the flight. The flight? Oh, what's the word? I'm not even looking. Yeah, flight. Yeah, flight. And this gives you tons of Primo Gems if you complete uh, each of the quests. Especially the, uh, the dragon one, the three-headed dragon. I'm pretty sure it gives you three... Uh, 60 Primo Gems if you complete 3 quests, so that should be like, uh, yeah, I, I, can't, I can't be also do the math in my head, but still, you get a lot of Primo Gems by doing this quest, the fleeting colors in flight. So guys, 100% do 
do these two events they are definitely worth it the fleeting colors and flight event is gonna end in five days and 16 hours so you guys better hurry up and i need to hurry up because i haven't even thought today because i need to complete other quest to unlock another this. method is to download the mihoyo lab you know why because the mihoyo lab gives you different types of rewards every single day and by complete by collecting every single daily reward from the mihoyo lab you'll get 60 primo gems because um every four days or bits is gonna be any random days basically it will give you 20 primo gems and, in, and if you collect all primo gems in the mihoyo lab um you know thing you'll get 60 but if it's your first time downloading the mihoyo lab you'll get free 100 primo gems straight in the bat yes guys 100 free primo gems oh my god that was kind of insane when i got it without even doing it i mean you know with uh, by calling, um, downloading the app Miho you lab so if you guys don't know how to download it uh, it's in the play store app and the apple app uh, make sure you download it guys and get your free primo gems so yeah guys that's pretty much it for the video i hope this video helped a lot for you uh hopefully you guys get over 5000 or 7000 primo gems before the 2.5 update and i wish you the best of luck of getting bell or yaimiko or kokomi i am not gonna summon for kokomi i am never going to probably bell yeah yaimiko maybe later but who knows what's gonna happen but yeah uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next video well hold on hold on before i uh cut out the video make sure you leave a like comment and subscribe hit the post notification bell so you don't miss any of my brand new videos and um i guess that's it yeah i'll see you guys in the next video chrono signing out